Yeah, you taking a big bite. No, you taking a big step there. Yeah, you want to pull it out? And that's how I'll usually lay my gun. It's like you got that right there. Like you said, it takes a baby stick. A little stick to so get used to it. Yeah, I need to go get a scope. Damn. <laughs> Shit blew all over me. Right there. Can you see out over at Field? Is it like it? Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Boy. Boy, huh? <clears throat> after you shoot one, it'd be a while before you can go find it. Yeah, I think you got five minutes to get there. I'm sure I'll get faster. Oh, yeah. We don't really want to get real fast. So. Yeah, that's when you mess up. And that would be a bad day. I'm going to bring my harness out here my that I had when I did cable. Have it up high under my arms, wrap around that tree, and just take it up every time. But you don't want to get real fast trying to get a deer anyway. Once you shoot it, just watch which way it goes. Yeah. Just if you don't boot it, just go right over in that woods there and lay down. Keep, you, keep your eye on it and where, what direction it runs off in. The seat part just to tilt it so it falls on down. There you go. There you go. Easy. <laughs> you can build some steps. <laughs> you can get that wood up off of it, uh, up off, like off, off the floor. Or to get air in it, run it in through the block right here. Right through the yeah, to the side. It's pretty, the side. That's pretty slick, ain't it, Floyd? Yeah, it is. 
we made us a freaking rocket stove. There's heat coming off the top of that thing. Yeah, buddy. Should be pretty safe, I'd say. So we at we at my original spot, place that I camped when I very first started coming down in here. Before I ever went down to the creek, I camped right here in the summertime. Got a couple videos of it. It was a two-parter, but uh, it was hot, man. Flies out the you know what in the summertime, sticky. But I camped right here on this little bench. Look at the bench now. <laughs> <laughs> I think I did my Matilda pack, Helicontax Matilda pack review out here at this spot too. And that bench was still in good shape and I slept on it that night. There's some heat, there's heat coming out of there, man. Good heat coming out of that. Is that turn red right there? I don't need to pop. He's just glowing. Oh, okay. Yeah, we can put us a, a grill grate on here. It'll hang over a little bit. It'll be perfect. It'll be a lot easier cooking right here than bending down, squatting, hurting me back. So we're moving to hunt camp here to here, and uh, we was just right over here. I was on that. I was climbing, this, climbing a tree. Mm -hmm. Boy, if that block cracks. Man, look at that. You got flames right in the can now. Rocket. Rocket stove. So when we were out here camping the other night, you were wearing a uh, South Carolina Gamecock shirt, sweatshirt. Are you a Gamecock fan? No. No. See, Carolina Chris outdoors was watching. He said, he "said you got uh, you got the right kind of people hanging out with you with the, with the Gamecock sweatshirt on." <laughs> and I told Chris I would. Uh, he called me and I told him I would investigate and see if you were like a real deal Gamecocks fan. No. So you just, just a sweatshirt, right? Sorry, Chris, just a sweatshirt. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I don't really, I don't even really watch sports anymore. But, uh, never have, never will. when I did, I was a Tar Hole fan. Tar Hole. <laughs> but ever since all this, you know what going on, I just quit watching sports. It's all about money. It ain't about sports, it's about money. Me and the wife, we uh, grilled some kebabs last night. So I brought a little bit of that. Chicken and peppers and onions. We're just going to kind of heat that up a little bit. Eat it with some of that rice. Got red beans and rice. The rocket stove idea worked, but it was putting off too many down sparks. So, and these brick are cracking. Look at that crack. We gotta refine this. Pretty good. Little cooking stove set up. The rock stove is a little dangerous, especially with the wind kicking up a little bit. It's not bad, is it, boy? No, it ain't bad enough. Well, we're one step closer to uh, hunting out here. I like that climbing stand. It's a little sketchy, but I, I'm, I'll get used to it. We're gonna finish grubbing on this, and appreciate you watching. See you on the next one.